Hello and welcome to Media Pool. I'm Gemma and in this video we will be talking about semiotics, how it is defined and how it might be understood. Semiotics is the analysis of signs and symbols and how meaning is created, interpreted and communicated by such signs. Some would argue that semiotics is a vital concept in which focuses on how we understand and interpret the world around us, usually subconsciously. The most commonly recognised theorists for determining the concept of semiotics are Saussure and Pierce. Both are critiques of semiotics but have two slightly different perspectives. Saussure proposed that a sign consists of a physical signifier, i.e. what it says on the tin, for example a gesture, word, image or something at face value, and the signified, which is the idea or emotion associated with such a gesture, word or image. Saussure was a linguist, he focused his studies primarily on language signs. He explained that the relationship between the signifier and the signified are arbitrary. For example, he explained that when we hear or think of the word cat, we automatically associate or connote the image of a cat. The linguistic sign is arbitrary because the word cat has no connection in its sound or visual value with what a cat is really like. We just think of it automatically. Another way of understanding Saussure's view is by thinking of the traffic light. When we see red, the signifier, we interpret it as the meaning of stop, the signified. And this is the same to that of amber, get ready, and green, to go. Pierce expanded on Saussure's perspective, suggesting that we break down the concept of semiotics to another level. He explained that there are not only linguistic signs, but also gestures, dress codes, traffic signs, advertisements, and many more that produce meaning too. He said we have three prolific ways of understanding media texts, iconic, symbolic, and indexical. He explained that a symbolic sign refers to the work of Saussure, where the relationship between the signifier and the signified are arbitrary, like the word cat that we addressed earlier. When regarding an iconic sign, he explained that this is where the signifier resembles the signified. For example, when we see a road sign of someone digging, we know to expect people digging or roadworks. With an indexical sign, it would be where the signifier is linked directly to the signified. For example, when we see smoke, we think fire. Saussure and Pierce both have viewpoints in which help us to understand how we might interpret media and the ways in which something at face value can mean something much more complex under the surface. That's all from me now, thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please click like, comment or subscribe to our channel. This has been me, Gemma, from Media Pool. Thank you for watching.